Alright folks, here we have what I like to call the shark. Welcome to the channel, I'm Blue Dragon, and today we have something big for you. A house tour of a squad base. Let's have a look around, shall we? This is the squad base for one of, if not the, biggest squads on the ZTV server. Scumdog Millionaires. As you can see, a lot of time, effort, planning, and all that sort of thing has gone into this base. It is enormous. Apparently, it takes around 1900 toolbox charges to maintain this base. Tell you what, I reckon you could get your daily exercise just by doing a lap or two around the outside. So as to how they decided on the design, Sasha, who is one of the squad members, set up a private server and they built a few different designs of base with this one being the winner. This building actually only uses one flag, taking up most of, but not the whole flag zone. I have lined up to get a tour of the inside as well. Sasha is going to give us the grand tour. Here lies Radioactive Man, RIP. So apparently, Radioactive Man is a buried chest of all of the radioactive gear from an event in the radiation zone. And here's Ash Smash, obviously another scum dog squam squad member floating around in base. As you can see, a nice big open area for car parking, and I believe some squad shenanigans like flying a plane in through the front gate, possibly while people are standing in the gate. So apparently the corner units are all shared spaces where squad mates store their loot. The one in this corner is the crafting and quests area with tools, a workbench for crafting, as well as quest storage. With each cabinet dedicated to one of the ZTV quests. It looks like Ash is working on a quest now. Let's go up and have a look at the view upstairs, shall we? Check that out. Galan's base over there. Hey Galan. Not sure if anyone's home. Bloody lovely view up here. B2 airport over that way. Yeah. I could get used to a view like this. Very nice. Sasha is taking us over to their room here to show us what the inside of the personal rooms is like. So each of the rooms has a similar layout with furnishings and storage to each squad mate's own taste. Very pretty. Over in this corner, 
we have the armory where each cupboard has specific weapon types in it and there are also cupboards for attachments and ammo and there is Horus's room you'll remember Horus from my previous videos where they recorded some footage for me. There goes Hash. Com's room. Obviously Com likes his guns. And hunting. Great view of the B2 airport from here. Well, he's got a great view from there, hasn't he? Looks like Com's trophy collection has spilled out from here. Maybe he has a few too many. Maybe Crusty Doibs going in through Doibs' room to go and have a look out at the Scum Dog Airport. Private airport where they have room for several planes to be parked securely at any time. Only one in here today, as you can see. A lovely little orange and pink number. There you go, folks. There you have it. Everyone say a big thanks to Sasha for the tour. I've been looking forward to this one for a while now. Hope you enjoyed this as much as I have. A bit of a look into what can be achieved by a larger squad on a PvE server. Please make sure to give the video a like, and if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on all the awesome content I have coming out in the future. Thanks for watching. Blue Dragon out. See ya.